Good morning, traders. Well, U.S. equities rallied for a second day on uh, further stability in the banking sector. That was helped by comments from Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen that uh, the U.S. banking sector was strong and, and very liquid. Um, all major indexes finished in the green with a big bounce in regional banks seeing the Russell 2000 outperform. That was up almost 2% with uh, the Nasdaq not too far behind. Um, an easing of fears saw the market reprice uh, a higher chance of a Fed rate, a Fed rate hike later today. Um, 25 basis points is, is priced in at 86%. This is only a, this is a 50-50 bet only a few days ago, so a big repricing um, on, on this improved sentiment we've seen. Now, unsurprisingly, in FX markets, that saw the US dollar stronger against most its peers. Um, the big exception was the euro, which continued to rally on some hawkish comments from the ECB. It set new March highs and is on the way to test the Feb highs the way it's going. Hi, um, higher yield differentials didn't help the end. Um, the 10-year US, 10-year JGB, that once that differential blows out a bit, it's, it's, it's a big headwind for the yen. So that dropped on the day. Um, the Kiwi dollar also was one of the laggards with recession fears still lingering and, and the Kiwi dollar being quite sensitive to risk. Um, Higher yields, improved risk sentiment, and also saw gold take a big hit. That was down almost $40 on the session and uh, settled around the 1940 US dollar an ounce level. Oil continued its rally from Monday. Um, again, on improved risk sentiment, we saw that bounce above the $69 a barrel level. Um, stopped just short of its $70 resistance level, which will be a big level to watch. It was strong support, now looking like strong resistance. So a break and a hold above that could see a higher run. Um, if it holds gold, oil, you could see, see it drop lower from here. Now tonight, um, the first of the central banks are to have their rate decision. This is the big one, the FOMC. So as I said before, 86% chance of a 25 basis point hike. Um, I think most of the action will come out of the, the statement that's released with this decision. And now, whether the Fed references the latest banking crisis, um, traders will be looking to get any clues of, of what their actions will be going forward.